Good evening, everybody. We're going to do a uh, an update on the T195 I've been restoring. It's uh, currently here behind me on the floor. A bunch of more old mobiles on top of it. Anyway, <clears throat> this is the uh, the PA section I have removed, and uh, we uh, we're trying to figure out what uh, what the failure uh, was. There was a uh, so you've been working on this. Uh, we fixed a uh, a uh, shorter capacitor in one of the uh, the low voltage uh, solid state dynamotor, and uh, we uh, replaced a few tubes. But uh, there was still a problem, and what it turned out to be was the uh, the PA blower here is uh, in the uh, in the PA here. It uh, wasn't operating, so it's kind of a cool th system they have. If you don't have the PA blower operating, it uh, there's a little heater in there that heats up a switch that uh, opens and shuts the unit down, which is what the failure I was getting. So according to the diagram, <coughs> which is here, it should be just a DC blower. However, that was the 1950s schematic. So as we can see here, this here is actually the the PA blowers, this motor here, and there's this little board attached. So it's actually a little AC powered. Uh, here's the diagram. It's actually a little uh, AC motor powered by a uh, little chopper circuit there. So what had happened was the uh, that didn't work. Um, it turns out that uh, these uh, very unusual power transistors these are germanium power transistors. One of them shorted, so uh, I managed to replace those with a. Uh, I replaced two of them with a tip 127. So seems to work quite nicely. So uh, we're going to shove this back together and see if we can get the uh, get the thing to uh, complete its auto tuning sequence. Thanks for uh, watching, and we'll uh, give you an update uh, sooner than later. Okay, so we got our. Uh, PA section back together again. Uh, once we put it back together, we found that uh, the fan wouldn't start reliably. So uh, you gotta change uh, our 241 and our 242, 47 ohms. They're uh, 23.7 according to the diagram. So I bumped that up to twice double those essentially. Just uh, randomly picked a uh, number in the middle there, and uh, 47 seems to work quite nicely. So the tip 127s to replace these unknown germanium power transistors and uh, seems to work quite well so uh, there you go